Well, the hunt is on this evening for a killer after a housing authority officer is found dead in Central City. The 45 year old man, who has not been publicly identified, was found inside of his vehicle. The man was found in the 2300 block of Arado Street. WDSU anchor Latanya Norton is on your side with more on the investigation into the officer's death. It's, it's a horrible day for us. Uh, it's truly sad. Uh, it's, it's, this, there's a young officer that was taken way too soon. A sad day for the Housing Authority of New Orleans Police Department as one of their own is killed in the line of duty. Such a tragic loss. Uh, we've never had an uh, on-duty death in, in the department's history. The officer was shot. He was fatally wounded. The car was moving. Superintendent Michael Harrison of the New Orleans Police Department says the NOPD received the call just before 7 o'clock Sunday morning. That's when he rushed to the scene. Harrison says the officer who joined Hanel's police force two years ago was working a patrol assignment on an overtime basis in the area to secure the construction site. It appears, says Harrison, that the officer's vehicle was moving at the time of his death and came to arrest at Irado and South Robertson. We don't know what happened. We don't want to speculate, and we don't have the answers to many of the questions. Uh, our homicide team, our coroner's office, they're processing the scene right behind us as we speak. Harrison says the shooting happened in a block that isn't very populated. The NOPD continues to canvass the neighborhood, investigating, working to get more answers. It's a tough day, so it's a very hard thing to watch one of your colleagues uh, lose their life in the line of duty. On your side, LaTanya Norton, WDSU News. The NOPD says its prayers and thoughts are with the officer's family. They also are providing grief counseling services to members of the Hano Police Department.